Okay, research. So we can unlock. Add one level one or lower Hana card from the deck to hand. Cards executed with this card are not removed from the field. And delay all enemies by two turns. So, mastery system, the more we win, the more we can unlock. I know you can get the uh, protagonists. Protagonists, at least you can get the... At least the protagonist from... Um, I think mm -hmm. that's it. One step from Eden. Um, plus some other crossover cards. Which actually is really cool. I love the fact... I love it when developers do that. So we can redo that two more times uh, with the other two characters, or we could go on with the story. Oh, interesting. So that's a way for you to upgrade the other decks? Yeah. Well, increase your mastery level, I think. Mm -hmm. yeah, let's, let's do it. I want to play the game. We've been doing a lot of tutorials and dialogue. And I want to play some of the other characters. So idle or... Aurora. Aurora. We'll just roll idle. See if it can make it work. So she has music based. And generic cards. Hey, thank you, Verizoc, for the 500 bits. Okay. So this character is really weird. I think you showed up just after I did the tutorial. Mm -hmm. Ah, Forte. Of course it would increase. Oh, what's this one do? Play one Muse card in your trash. Play, Play to, to the field. field. And then... Target one. So this this one pulls from the trash. That's actually... That's a good way of sustaining. Okay. I have to attack with these. Still kind of messy. Uh, let's see. Double Eighth Muse. Attack twice. Did you already use her ability to bring something from the graveyard? Well, that's interesting. Does Miki allow you to initiate the attack of another card? Yeah, so both of the Muse cards do that. Mm hmm. Okay. Unfortunately, I don't have anything at this point, so we gotta do this. Cards ex executed with this card are not removed from the field. Oh. Another Ari Force. Deal one magic damage ahead. Push the target back. What's Shatter? Constant cor correction might not be bad. Select one card in the field. Deal damage to all enemies equal to its current health and... Damage to itself equal to its max health. Oh, ouch. Shatter? I, it's still super good, though. Uh, let's see. I'm just going to grab a lot of those. Oh, threat level is a huge issue for this character. What's up with threat? I suppose I didn't get to get a little tutorial on that. Uh... Threat increases enemy challenge. Shoot. Um. Think, okay, that gets it kind of. Uh, let's see. Start with force. There we go. Hmm. Then I'm gonna shatter force, which kills both of them, puts us back down. That's this is neat. Hard to work with, but neat. Very indirect. Okay. Let's see. Who's that one? 
Oh, there's the Fermata. Play her down. Order Muse there, move there. Okay. Yeah, because half of my actions are not How are, how are not they getting aggressive. boosted? What with was that? How are they getting boosted with the fours? Okay, that didn't do anything. Uh, the fours? Uh, when, when you're using the muses to have the quarter notes attack. Because it seems as though they're doing more damage than they should. Uh, oh, I see. Uh, so quarter muse does four damage. Ah, interesting, but... So but it can't isn't... attack. It has to be executed to, be to actually do the damage. Mm-hmm. Getting a full deck. Yeah, I don't have too much of a choice. Equalize Muse, discard a card. Get rid of Femta. I don't know if I need it. Okay. Order Muse. I can see Femta Muse being real good, I just have to do it right. And it, this has not set me up. Okay. Oh. Yeah, that's... I'm not necessarily sure if that's the, uh... The right way to go, but... It's working. Clearing the field, yeah. Okay. It would definitely be the thing you'd have to worry about in games where you have resource expenditure. Kind of works. Okay, buff correct or er, buff shatter, wreck it. Let's see, what else do I have? Not too much. Good time for a reprogram, maybe. Yeah, let's grab it. So, do I have an? Yes, six magic damage ahead. We might as well grab Ooh. that one. I can see how Femta Muse is actually really good. Well, yeah, because you you initiate and execute, but only Armada actually perishes. Yeah. I just have to set it up right. Uh, let's see. So if I do that, it buffs the damage, it destroys them. Okay. I'm just gonna get her down there. I have an equalize. We got a fermata. Equalize. Oh, it's the Portamuse Plus. Yeah. Okay, didn't quite work the way I wanted it to. Yeah, that one bug was able to kill your eighth note. Oh no! That's fine. They wiped you out. Okay, so if I do that... I've just got to have Force take the damage. Uh, that's awkward. It's fine, though. Grab the Quarter Muse. Activate the Quarter Muse. It's gone. Yeah, it was a good thing that you had found a Airy or one of the... Is it Airy and Meek here? Yeah. yeah. 
Well. Let's. That one's going to attack. Yeah, and then we reprogram. Because I gotta get my deck back. Warning. Of course it is. Pop the ember there. An error. Yeah. Uh, when the threat level maxes out, I lose half my health and the oh. threat goes back up. It's not fun. So you've been playing perfectly up to that point. Mostly, yeah. Because you only just lost half your health. Let's see. Let's see what else we have. Might as well just trigger that one. Mm -hmm. There's a whole new spread. Okay. Well, if you... You could activate that ability, but then Fermata would be destroyed. There's also Shatter. Yeah, I'm just gonna grab Shatter. Ouch. It's rough. So many of those are at zero. If the Ari hadn't taken damage, I would have been okay. We might have some troubles here. You might also be suffering from... Uh, you know how you can have deck bloat? Yeah. Where the cards that you need might be buried, if, and so it's better to have fewer cards so that you get the ones that you definitely need. Yeah, you are 100% correct on that one. Because... Force is interesting. I haven't really seen you use Ember. Okay. Let's reprogram. Yeah, Ember was supposed to be like a, a nice hand manager, but for the most part, I've just been using it to... Block attacks. Yeah. No, you're gonna have two HP, aren't you? Unless I'll, you can destroy. I'll be okay. Got that. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Let's get rid of the forces. Let's get rid of the embers. Gonna get rid of constant correction. Let's see. Wait, oh. what about health would be at zero? I, uh... So you have to have some at this point. Yeah, because my health is based on my deck. Okay, let's, um... Put that down. We're just going to attack. Yeah. This this one's a bit tough. Yeah, because you had the threat annihilate half your health early on. Mm hmm
Oh. What happened there? It's because the fermata was in the same row. Mm -hmm. Wanda, remember? When you execute, everything else stays on the field. Oh, dead, shoot. Though. I took damage. She's tough. We also just got kind of weird garbage. Uh, that I wasn't exactly used to. I think I understand how she works better. I have to set more things up than I have been. Mm -hmm. And yeah, I gotta remember that I can actually activate things just with the execute button here. I don't actually have to use the muse cards to execute. Not that that changes too much. Uh, You're not going to put an equalize down at all? No? Um, I might. Oh, that we was a fort. Mm-hmm. That's inconvenient. Oh, uh, yeah. oh no, that was yeah, that was rough. That was bad. So what? You had to. I really don't like the discard card because I often mildly squander it. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see. Let's see. This one's attacked twice. And then we should hit the reprogram. Because this will give me more. So we get another Miki Muse, which is good. That's Flashbang, fine. which is amazing. Cinder, which is really good. And Force. To some degree, I'll take them all. Okay, start with the Flashbang. That's easy. Let's see. Order Muse. Force. Equalize Muse. Let's just lose her. Get a Miki down. Uh, let's see. Oh, they resist it, of course. Uh. Okay. Now we don't have to worry. Get another one of these down. Okay, set that up there. Now, does this... Yeah, no, it, it, it increases. Previously, I thought it set it to, which which confused me greatly. That just damaged Miki. Yeah. Do you need a reprogram? Yeah. In retrospect, absolutely do. Discard management is actually really tough in this. Okay. So do you have to put her down? Then we execute. Yep. Still puts me in a bit of a rough spot, though, for damage. We're in the cinder. The double eighth. Shoot. You haven't been using your muses to activate the cards anymore. Um, because I haven't needed to as much, kind of, sort of. What I should probably do is use my muses to attack a little bit more. Uh, let's see. I do have three bits. Let's reprogram now.
So Let's did you see. still take half damage from an overload? Yeah. Yeah, I lost a lot. It's, um... So what do you say makes the fruit deck easier than this one? The fruit deck, fruit deck has a lot of free damage, which keeps this down. Mm -hmm. You know, the lemons just attack automatically. The apples summon themselves. Yeah. Let's see. Oh. Four magic damage ahead. Oh, it's an AoE! Which is why it's... Uh, no? Okay. I mean, it was four damage immediately above. Trigger this one. Uh, let's see. Burn that. Grab both. Attack. Miki Muse. Trigger. Knock it down. You also have the flashbang if you ever need to delay them, but at the moment, I are you just trying to navigate which ones you prepare to lose? Yeah, let's do the flashbang. You do a free program. Yeah, that was kind of the plan. Oh, a quarter rest. I haven't seen that which one yet. Which draws cards, which is pretty good. Might as well upgrade those, and I'll just grab the fireball because mm -hmm. easy damage. Anything that I'm not using here. I'm still mixed on Equalize Muse, so I think I'm going to get rid of that one. Okay. Or maybe not. I don't know. It's like equal parts... Discard one card, draw two cards. Yeah, it's yeah. like, it's okay. Maybe it's good. I don't know. Okay. There, attack with her. Move that anywhere. Move that there. Grab the force. Oh, that brings the strong bug to the forefront. Okay. Didn't do what I wanted it to do. This is just awkward. Yeah, not strong enough for that one. Yeah, so if I had attacked first... Can't flashbang them. Well, the equalize will allow you to discard one card, draw two cards, but yeah, but I have to avoid taking damage, damage here. Ah, uh, yeah. And you couldn't have used the flashbang. No, they'd already been slain. Ah, uh, slain, knocked out. I don't know. Thank you, fireball. Yeah, what we needed was the fireball. Mm -hmm. Okay, there we go. Oh, let's see, do we draw two? No, just put it there. 
Okay. Hit it once. Summon her. Got a double eighth note. Attack. Mm. It's down. What kind of damage does the double eighth note do? Uh, two damage. So that would be good for taking out the side rows. Yeah, it would have been... Oh, I guess I could have moved it over. See what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, because you could take out an entire side row and then go after the strong one in a bit, but... Are you going to activate okay. your ability? Or? Yeah, so I'm going to activate okay. both of those. Then I'm going to activate this one. Mm -hmm. And yeah, then she gets one. nuked, but that's fine. And then we just force that guy in the back. Okay. We get another fort, which is actually good. Alright, this is better. Mostly. You have seven health. Better but at least I time. understand this character a little bit better. I think I will say she is still definitively my least favorite. But I understand how and why. Okay. Especially because I can use this poten potentially to increase the damage of some s stuff. I. Ugh. <laughs> now, for a double eighth, it can't attack twice on a boss, right? Uh, it can. Really? Hmm. Hit him with the fireball. Can you use her ability? I can. Can she make a fireball go again? No. Well, then what, why is it selected? So executing it makes it attack. Uh, but nah. then it deletes it from the field. I see. What if I just do this? Ah, nothing... them to activate it see yeah that's cool uh brought some fragments up on the side mm-hmm okay slow them down by a bit awkward that my reprogram is in the very end uh would you want to execute a row before you activate that? Maybe not. Yeah, not overwhelmingly. It wouldn't do much damage. Oh. Oh, no. So that guy has a three attack? Yep. That is... That is Hard good. to work with. Yep. And that one's going to go off right now. Yeah, this is going to hurt in a not-so-fun way. Well, they're going to go run right after the other, too. Oh. Yep, Place that wrong. The one on the left. I have to play the reprogram just to get... Just to get cards. Yeah. Oh, can the flashbang hold them back or... Yeah. Okay. That's a little bit better. Yep. Okay. 
I'm going to do equalize. We're just going to burn reprogram as much as I hate to do so. Mm -hmm. You're not going to bring out an eighth note to be activated by Airy? Okay. Airy. That's a bit of damage. Okay, we've already got a fort muse. Let's do that. Grab. Place. Boss is going to attack again. Ah, shoot. Oh, no. We lose. Man! This got Didn't tough. Didn't have enough cards. This character is hard to work with. Are you sure you don't want to fight with someone else? Yeah, let's uh let's let's try the other the other character. Uh Aurora. Like I said, Fruit Girl is just so much easier. I love the complexity of this though. But it is also hard. Here we go. But yeah, these cards can at least attack. They might behave weird, but they can attack. There we go. Uh, let's see. Refresh. Bow. Back. Okay. I mean, they do a lot of damage, and... Yep. The opponent doesn't really oh. have much time to... Shoot. What, what's wrong? Uh, I'm going to retry. I <laughs> killed too many things. I was wasting my, my uh, loot bits. Oh, you forgot to check your loot? I was I was on a bit of a rampage. <laughs> well, because you can only have six loot at a time. Mm hmm Yeah, so... Should have been paying more attention to that. Maybe it wasn't an issue. But it might have been? Well, okay, one okay, creature so has we're gonna to be on the right. Oh. Oh, you can actually upgrade your katana hana. Yeah, might as well. Don't think I want to upgrade the bow. Okay. Because that doesn't actually increase his base damage. Actually, I'm going to do it anyway. Okay. Yeah, being able to do three damage is pretty nice. Okay. This is definitely more direct. This is so much easier. <laughs> Let's see. What else do we have? And that's our hand. Reset this. Yeah, especially because I can do three damage. Mm hmm That allows you to take out the strong bugs with ease. Yep. There we go. I guess we might as well just reset for a moment. Okay, you're gonna get six out of six loot soon. As soon as you destroy the this small one. bug. Max! Okay, so we're max loot. Uh, let's see. Yeah, now would be a good time for a reprogram. He just attacked. Wow. Yeah, look at this. So much better loot. So Ooh, much better nine, everything. Lantern? Okay. Haven't seen the kunai before. What do they do? One damage to all enemy cards. Gosh, oh. th that's obscene. <laughs> Add one level, one level one or lower Hana card from deck to hand. Except for your lantern. So that just could you potentially upgrade more bohanas? Or I mean, no, I can't upgrade any more bohanas, but I can upgrade my katana Hana. Um, 
In that case, we should probably grab at least one Bohana. All right. I was originally kind of tepid on how this character functions. I'm no longer. <laughs> real good. Let's see. Put that down. Attack. Refresh. Oh, can only kunai once. That's fine. But it is worth keeping in mind. Now, what does the Shide do? Let's oh, it reset. allows you to bring a card back to your hand. Okay, shoot this guy. We're not going to take much damage. Kill. Kill. I'm surprised. Haven't you noticed that you are almost up to the boss and you have only seven health because you've never had to upgrade? I uh, no, it's because I upgraded so many of my you, cards. Yeah, you just don't have many cards in your deck. Yeah. I suppose. Yeah, so we're we're in fact at the boss right now already. Yep. So this gets a little dicier. At least you can use the katana hanas. Oh, but they only do, they only take one damage at a time. The little bites. Mm -hmm. Which would be great for this, the kunai, actually. Yeah. Probably use the Shide to bring out another card as well. Well, Shide uh, resets, resets a card's oh, ability. Oh, okay. I see. So this way I can reset that. Oh, it didn't manage to. Oh, it did attack. Did it? Yeah, it did. Oh, you don't have anyone to defend yourself. Okay. Ow. Oh. Yep. Oh, he did the group hit. It's fine. I'm gonna grab the lantern just to have something else. Okay. Go oh, there. Sword there. Does not take a turn to use, but it's still got it. Okay, grab that. And wiped it out, but that's okay. How did it get wiped out? Uh, oh, did it, he use a special ability? Yeah, he's got a he's got an AOE. Uh, that's kind of rude. Right, let's reprogram. We're still doing way better. In fact, he dead. Bye. Okay, everything is good. That we, only we took can... six minutes. Yeah. Not much longer. Oh, we didn't get a... You didn't get any special stuff? Did or I? No, no, I did. You did. It just didn't play the animation. Ooh, Bloom a Bloom Hana. Hana. Activate all effects of Hana cards in the same row as this card. Ignores restrictions. That's obscenely good. Multiply the power of your attacks that go through this card by two. Oh. Oh, oh so it's a gate that you put in front of it. Yeah. Select one inactive card on your field, except Spark, and reactivate it. That's cool. Uh, let's see. Can you modify their decks, or do they automatically get added? Uh, no, so those show up in the item pools. Mm -hmm. So now we can look at this. Okay. Oh, board skins. Operators. So there's a couple more. 